Ah, okay. Now this is a this is a very unscripted video. Kind of this is kind of an impulsive idea I had. Why wow, I should probably turn off my freaking Steam overlay. Um, let me just. All right. Well, okay. So this is pretty impulsive, but I just had an idea to do this. Um, I'm kind of a tearless guy. I'm not very good at explaining things or anything. But actually, I'm not a tier. Why did I say that? I'm actually horrible at ranking things and not very good at it at all. But I like tier list, um, so that's what makes me a tier list guy. Okay, before I get this started, and people uh, people are for sure going to comment like instantly, yo, this was so biased, I love this guy, and you put him in B tier. Okay, look, yes, it's biased, okay. One of the guys in this tier list, I literally met this guy when I was like four years old, like, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be biased, okay. And I'll just get this out of the way, like, I don't think I'm very good. Like, I, I don't hold myself to a very high standard. I don't edit my videos very well. Uh, I can't just cut up clips maybe i'll put like a funny little meme every now and then but i don't i don't go above and beyond you know what i'm saying my thumbnails are pretty generic so i'm not gonna act like i'm snobby and better than these people right i'm probably the only person gonna be in d tier i think everybody on this tier list is pretty good and there's also a lot of people that i'm sure are pretty big and are pretty good that i just haven't seen everyone on this tier list i'm familiar i'm familiar with to an extent so if your favorite youtuber is like this niche guy of 60 subscribers like just comment him down and i'll probably check him out also one more thing i should clarify before we start this is that a very big bias i'm gonna have is just what type of videos do I like? So I would say this um, game's YouTube space. Bro, there's like an ad up here and it's like driving me, it's driving me crazy. Well, I don't think I can do anything about that. This website sucks. Wow, and it was a pop up one. And another ad. Yo, this website's trash, bro. Damn. Oh. Uh, does this look better? I feel like this is kind of iconic though. Like this little view here. Eh, whatever. I'll do this because the ads are driving me crazy. All right, all right getting off topic so there's two types of content when it comes to this game there's like the, the daily uploads of like hey guys today we're gonna review this unit here are the top 10 years for this update here's like a, a showcase like whenever a new update comes out they drop showcases for every single unit i call that more like the daily upload like almost like a, a vlogger type channel if it makes sense and then you have more of the long form content not necessarily long form in terms of like 30 minute long videos but like people who condense like a week or two of them grinding the game into one video and i would say i definitely fall under more back category right i upload super scarcely so while someone like vanilla or mr rhino fall in the latter category well not the latter i'm the latter in the first category where you know they they upload very often but their videos don't typically, I'm not saying it doesn't have much substance, but it's usually just more about like one unit or like one thing in particular. Does that make sense? Now, I personally prefer my style of videos more, not like my videos in particular, but more videos are, are about grinding and getting something done within the video than more about a specific unit or a showcase. If that makes sense, there's plenty of channels that make videos about tournaments or showcases, but frankly, those channels don't have much personality to me, so I wouldn't care for them, you know? That's just my opinion. If you have a different opinion, go for it. Uh, I don't know if I can make this public. If I can, I'll probably put it in the description. So go check it out. Okay, enough talking. Uh, let's just start with the order they're in, honestly. Okay, so OTM doesn't even make videos in animated matches anymore. This is kind of just like a troll pick. Uh, I did like him a lot when he made animated matches videos, though. He's actually pretty chill. And I hate... Okay, there's a... If you don't know who OTM is, he's like this retired COD gamer who makes animated matches videos. I hate people are like, this guy is 40 years old. He needs to hop off Roblox. Bro. Like, this guy gets paid like a decent amount to just chill and play roblox and hang out with his kids for a living you're saying that's better than working like in the salt mines when you're in your 40s like just let the man chill bro having fun isn't gate gate kept by an age like if you're one of those people like oh bro you need to grow up shut up bro you need to grow up all right come out he's chill i put him in a solid b tier not many people are gonna go and see honestly because i think everyone here is pretty good but i put him in b tier uh He's funny, and obviously the whole the reason why he quit Anime Adventures, I completely agree with. Um, he quit the game because of its scam-like features with the deal over heaven, his frustration like getting unique, and I completely understand where he's coming from, and I feel his frustration. So I think that kind of gives him a boost, even though he doesn't even make these videos anymore. I just think like you know I respect him for um sticking to his word and just quitting the game altogether, you know. Baps. Now this guy is pretty tiny. This guy's a pretty underground channel. And I will be real, this guy's humor is so niche. Like it's so stupid. And I think genuinely like 60% of people won't even get why I'm laughing at his stuff. But I find it so like I find this guy so funny for no reason. I can't even explain to you this guy's comedy. He'll just put like a random video of like some 
like five-year-old kid like falling off of his chair but if he, he puts at the right time in the video where i just like i start laughing at it like i don't i don't know you have to watch one of his videos i he has a contagious laugh um i like videos like his they're not very focused on anime branches gameplay specific but <laughs> they're more just of him having fun playing the game and if you just look at some of his thumbnails you can tell what i'm saying like this guy is ludicrous bro but he's funny i love him this guy's funny baps i've talked to him i've dm'd him before he's a chill guy too toad boy one of the goats of the community if you will uh toad boy is definitely the more like daily upload type of videos which like i said i don't like but i will say for being in that category he's probably the best you get in that category especially because he makes tier lists and i've i do watch some of his tier lists and they're pretty in-depth I think they definitely help out a lot of people who are new to the game. Um, he's pretty chill. I wouldn't say he's particularly funny, but I don't think he really tries to be that funny. He's kind of just like a chill person to watch, you know? I'm probably going to put him in... I'll put him in A just because for what he does, he's probably the go. Honestly, now that I'm thinking about it, who... Uh, S... I feel like none of these people are like that much better than each other. They put someone in the A. Eh. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I see how I'm feeling. All right, this guy's called Andravius, and a lot of you people, a lot of you guys are not gonna know who he is. He recently changed his profile pic, by the way. Now his profile pic is the the cover of his guild. This guy's the 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 leader of the number one guild in the game, Infinity, and he's kind of a controversial figure, from what I've heard. I've heard some people don't like him. Um, the few interactions I've had with him, he actually seems really nice. And he was actually the first person to get Ains when the Overlord update dropped, and he was kind enough to. I don't want to say kind enough. He made a video on it. Like it's not like he, I don't know why I said kind enough. That's weird. But whatever. He was the first person to get Ains, and he dropped the stats for everybody. And honestly, I just gotta respect him because he had to grind for like 16 hours straight to get it. But overall, I wouldn't say he's much of a YouTuber. He's like he's pretty, and he kind of just started out doing his thing. He has like a weird footing. I'm personally not that big of a fan of his thumbnails, but that might be something that touch on a bit more where i think i personally like thumbnails that incorporate the roblox um images of the characters more than just the pngs of the anime characters if that makes sense like bap baps is thumbnails there's a few that are good but a lot of them i can admit are pretty like gaka i just find them funny but yeah uh, but either way i don't think andravius tries that hard to be a youtuber it's more of a thing he's doing on the side so i think c is pretty fair and by the way c doesn't mean bad or anything i feel like there's a pretty bad connotation of c c is supposed to mean average guys i'm the only bad all right cause me now a lot of you guys aren't gonna know who cause me is either this guy's also pretty on the ground but his video Videos are pretty all right. Um, I don't think it's anything too particularly special. But I think what really makes Cosby stand out is just how young he is, bro. This guy cannot be older than 13 or 14, and he's actually making pretty decent videos. Like I'm almost envious because if I started doing what he was doing at his age, like I'd probably be Mr. Beast by now. Like I gotta respect this kid's hustle. All right, guys. Before we get into the video, I just want you to know I am gonna be doing a battle pass giveaway at 150 subs. So yeah, I will be doing daily giveaways every 50 to 100 subs because I want to give out to my fans because you guys deserve everything. So yeah, let's get straight into the video. And even though he is young and obviously like some of the humor falls flat for me, I still like this guy. Um, I smile while watching him. I'm not like rolling on the floor laughing or anything, but I'm gonna put him in B. I think it's a solid place. And I respect the grind. And honestly, if he keeps at it for a year or two, this guy is probably gonna get pretty big. Moss King, I think Moss King's gonna have to go to S, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Moss King's kinda, he's kinda the GOAT of anime branches right now. I'm not gonna lie. Um, he's kind of setting a new standard of like these super high octane edited videos. Now I've had some people have told me how they like they don't like this type of videos. I completely understand that. I, I know sometimes you watch the videos and it feels like a dopamine overload, like there's too much going on at once. But it's a very fast paced, high octane style of videos, and I, I'm a fan of it personally. Um, some of his videos are more like the long term stuff, like his Noob to Pro series, or some of his videos about grinding for a unit. But he also does more of the daily videos, and honestly, I respect him for trying to branch out. Like he does skit videos. Videos and a bunch of <laughs> random stuff when he can he does reaction videos you know um he's he has a good variety he has a very distinct personality and i think he, he he's just a good impression he i'm, I'm extremely biased because he's one of the first youtubers i ever came across and he really inspired me to get into more like of taking the content creation seriously but yeah bro this guy is just fire if you haven't already subscribed to him he's so close to 100k by the time this comes out i wouldn't be surprised if he has 100k right he's so close and he's been growing at an insane rate like when i found this guy i think he had 20k subs and he's almost at 100k in less than a year bro like this guy is exponentially growing you know all right crusher another super underground guy but he's in my discord server so it feels kind of mean for me not to have him he actually has a video that recently took off to pretty well i think he got like 30k views which are pretty decent numbers for this game um hold on let me take a sip of my diet coke <sighs> okay <clears throat> my phone so 
His videos are the more of the long form that I like, and I don't know how to describe him too well because okay, I don't know how to describe Crusher. He doesn't. I, I wouldn't say he tries too hard to be funny. He's more of just like long form videos, and he puts them in an entertaining way. I think he has some room to grow in terms of like better flowing his videos but overall i do enjoy them when i watch them and he has his brother draw some thumbnails for them and i think he makes some pretty good thumbnails for this game especially because a lot of the thumbnails nowadays kind of just like two of the roblox images slapped together you know so i think his thumbnails are pretty high quality especially for a channel of his size so if you haven't you should check him out let me know what you think this guy oh what's his name what's his name maz is it, is it maz no shot am i not sub to him no way <gasps> Oh, Mike. Mike loves Maul. Why did I think it's not Maul? Am I tripping? I'm not subscribed to him. Wow, I'm such a horrible person. Um, okay, my fault. I corrected it. I, I really thought I was subscribed. That's weird. Okay, so this guy has literally like one or two videos of Anime Adventures, but they're so good. Like, it's really my type of content, and it's super niche in this community. Like, it's a very well, you can tell he actually probably wrote a script for these videos, and they're well articulated, and, and actually pretty entertaining, not incredibly funny, but they're just good videos to watch. I'll put two of them up on screen right now. These two videos, I super highly recommend you check out if you haven't. I'm almost going to put him in A tier, even though he has very little videos. I think the videos he has made are both very, very good. I'm always a sucker for videos or, like, a video essay on blank, or I know it's kind of nerdy, or, like, um, just tier videos in general not tearless video what am i saying um or like analysis videos there we go like analysis analysis is there a plural for analysis analysis is uh, videos of that nature like these exp expl explanatory yo uh, I'm, uh, i need to stop using the big words bro the videos explain how things worked i like videos like that um well constructed his trading video even though i've never traded in this game was very informal very helpful liked it a lot jack the noob now i this guy i'm gonna be real he has to be a robot i don't under, i think he has like this guy, whenever an update drops within three hours, he has all the units evolved. Um, I don't understand how he does it. I think he has like uh, alt accounts and he evolves one for each alt account. Like, this guy's an insane grinder. Uh, personally, his channel doesn't have much personality because you know he just makes like reviews and showcases on new units. But I gotta respect the hustle. I put him low B because it's not really my type of videos. Actually, I might even put him in C just because you know it's not my type of videos and I can. But it's for sure helpful though. Like it's nice to be able to wake up like after an update drops and just search up anime adventures and find some of his videos. I particularly particularly wouldn't watch them but i appreciate you know make some pretty good videos bro this guy i don't remember his complete name it's something like hw and a few numbers or hz let me see if i can find him it is indeed hw5567 okay so this guy he's a very big roblox um content creator in general he just makes some videos anime adventures he kind of comes out like once in a blue moon to make a video but when he does make a videos they're kind of bangers not gonna lie i might have to put him i think i'll put him in top of b oh, i don't know i don't know i don't know I think I'll put him in top of B, but this guy comes once at Bloom when he makes a video on the game. And they're pretty good. Like, it, I'll be real, it's mostly just him like, I spent $20 million and I made it. Hey, but it's fun, you know? I won't lie. Like, yeah, it's like pretty, it's pretty pay to win stuff. But yo, you, you can't lie. It's entertaining, you know? Um, I appreciate the videos he makes. They usually get high view counts and they're pretty well edited because he's a pretty big content creator. Uh, I like it. I like it. Vanilla. Vanilla is very similar to Toad Boy, where he's kind of the goat of the industry. I think it's kind of a shame to put him anywhere else other than A. Um, I will say one critique I have of Vanilla is that whenever this guy goes live, I'll peep in his live stream, and then I'm not gonna, for one third of the live stream, he'll just be speaking Filipino, and I have no idea what he's saying. And okay, I'm not gonna tell him to not speak his native language, obviously, right? But it's just like I can't even watch his lives because I just don't know Filipino. So I'm kind of just there pretending to understand like, oh yeah, <laughs> and like half the chat is Filipino as well. So um, it feels like I'm not in the group, you know, for some reason, this game has a very large Filipino audience, like pretty big chunk of my fan base Filipino, but yeah, he makes some good videos though. Mr. Rhino, hmm, thinking low A or top of B. Mr. Rhino is very similar to Vanilla and Toad Boy. He makes these daily videos, top tens. I'll put him next to Vanilla because they're both very similar in content style. And they're both just kind of very big in their own sense. And I feel like that kind of gives him some credit. Uh, even though, like I said, these daily type of videos aren't necessarily what I would watch. I just, I do think the videos are pretty well in terms of quality. And I, I you know, once in a blue moon, I'll watch some of them and I find them pretty entertaining. Especially videos that are more like top tens, what to do pre to prepare for updates. Even though they're kind of repetitive in nature sometimes. But I respect the hustle you know and I, I just like the videos valor 
Valor kind of started this. I don't know if he started it, but I think he did start the trend of like reacting to lucky clips. And I mean, it's been the meta, bro. Like it's working out for a lot of people. So uh, do I watch his videos a lot? I would say a lot, but I do watch his videos every now and then. He's pretty good at talking. I can't tell how old this guy is. I watch his videos, bro. He's either like 15 or like 11. I literally have no idea. Um, It's actually pretty funny watching his old videos and watching his like voice slowly, slowly deepen with time. I'm not dissing you, by the way, Valor. I just have no idea how old you are but i i like his videos i like his videos i will say he's like he's a lot better at talking than i am and that's kind of a weird thing to say but i watch a video of him reacting and he actually he doesn't even have to cut the video that much because he literally just always has something to talk about or react to and i think that's the reason why i can never make those reaction type videos is because my reactions are just oh wow unique oh this guy wow he got unique again Wait, no way he got he got a shiny what like you know I, I i don't know how to explain it but i think he does a better job than i do in that regard you know say i don't uh, i'm gonna try to pronounce the guy's name sebastian it, it might just be sebastian spelled quirkily but i think it's like sebastian i don't my fault but i actually recently came across this guy one of his videos i, I, I don't want to say i blew up because it's not like oh well, he wasn't like a one hit wonder or anything but some of his videos have been taking off lately and i do like this guy's videos a lot i probably watched it a bit more than valor because they're more of that, that long-term content uh he definitely has potential and i can see this guy growing to be pretty big and also i'm I, i'm really happy for this guy he recently got his first ever unique um and it was on eins bro so what an insane first unique to get right but i like this guy's videos i recommend you peep them if you don't know him but yeah, I don't got too much to say now that I've covered a lot of these YouTubers because a lot of them fall into similar archetypes. Like Vanilla and Mr. Rhino's content is pretty relatively similar. Toad Boy, you could say the same for. I'd say Valor and actually, I guess Valor is kind of distinct in his daily uploads because he definitely does a lot more of like reactionary videos. Well, it's kind of similar to Moss King's, but just in a Moss King is a highly edited fashion. But I'm not going to give like a whole explanation for each YouTuber. I don't want to make this video like 50 minutes long. Jonas, Jonas LYZ. Well, let me just say immediately this guy is going at least an A. Jonas is so different. I guess different is the best way to describe it without like um, writing him a bit too hard. But Honestly, I might put him in S, bro. I might put him in S. I think Jonas is up, just up. He's a content creator that I've been wanting from this community, frankly, because, you know, it's not that he's like super edgy or anything, but definitely too many content creators for this game lean a bit too into the family friendly side for my personal enjoyment. Like, I'm not saying you that being edgy is funny or being vulgar is funny or anything, but it's just kind of a, a like a, bre a fresh of breath air to have somebody like him make videos where he and his, where it's mostly just him and his friends laughing you know like it's not him being like hey guys today we played anime adventures for 50 hours it's mostly just him and his friends just having fun if that makes sense um i like him and his little like friend group it's almost like the vanos gaming of this friend group i know one of his friends i think carlito started making videos i don't know if he did um i've met another one of his friends steven and i know one of his friends yokotsumi or something like that started making videos they're all pretty funny in their own right but they're very similar to jonas so i'm not gonna i didn't want to put them on the tier list because they they just started you know but I think Jonas is a pretty, he's pretty innovative when it comes to this game in the sense that I think his videos feel very distinct to these people. Um, even if you just saw the format of his videos, you can always probably tell it's a Jonas video even without him speaking, if that makes sense. He's also, he's also just pretty funny and entertaining in general, like his personality. Um, what the hell? I couldn't even say um without voice cracking. Uh, but yeah, I'm kind of doing like front flips on it. So I'm gonna stop complimenting him too hard. But I like what he's doing, Jonas. Keep with the good work. King Luffy. This guy's also kind of a troll pick, bro. King Luffy. <laughs> I haven't watched a video from this guy for so long, but I just remember it because he, he clickbaits so hard, bro. But it's so hard to the point that it went from being annoying to like actually just funny, like ironically funny. Like he would clickbait an Aaron Founder of like double unique and the video, he doesn't even have Aaron Founder. He's just talking about it. I'm like, bro, come, whatever. If you know King Luffy, you probably find this funny. If you don't, you're like, who is this guy? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Bonia Noob, this is one of my friends. So this is a, a friend of mine who saw me and another friend of mine doing videos and asked me on how he could do it as well. And I kind of gave him the basic ropes and he started doing it. I told him you should make a Noob to Pro series because people really like that. And like once you've gone a few episodes to combine them onto one longer type video and that'll probably do well. He ended up doing it and he actually did do pretty well. He has a few thousand subscribers, but he went to a trip to the Dominican Republic. And when that guy came back, he he was like, man, I'm tired of man. I'm running, bro. Like he doesn't ever touch the game again, pretty much. So he's switching to different types of videos, which I respect the hustle for. Um, his news 
his video is actually pretty funny and he is my friend so i'm incredibly biased but since he's not an anime adventures youtuber i'm obviously gonna put him like a c tier but while he was on here he's honestly going d because he doesn't make videos on this game like at all anymore but when he was on here i did like his videos a lot and he was like a genuine noob to pro because he was learning the game in the videos right so i definitely think his noob to pro is pretty fun to watch if you haven't watched it already i recommend you watch it Chuni, another person doesn't make videos on this game anymore, but also kind of when he did he used to make videos, he was kind of a goat in a sense. Uh, I never found Chuni too particularly funny. It's just not my type of humor, if that makes sense. Like he's kind of, he's kind of the guy to like say like, um, damn, it, it's so niche to explain, but he's the type of guy to say like, oh, this is giving me cancer. <laughs> okay, that, that doesn't make sense. I, that, I know that doesn't make sense at all, but his humor is just not that funny for me, but I did like his videos, especially there was a video he did of his stream highlights that I watched forever ago back in the day and i can honestly sympathize with the story a lot with how this game's developers treated him you know respect to chuny respect to chuny chrissy wissy this is a guy that i have known since honestly i was probably like probably two years old i'm not gonna lie i'm <laughs> like three or two years old um he's an old neighbor of mine and he saw me making videos on this game he asked me for help on how to do it as well can i say i i'm the only reason he's popular yeah probably but even besides that, even though he just stole everything from me and he has no ounce of creativity and everything he's ever done is just trying to rip me off. Like he wants to be me so bad, you know, he makes pretty good videos and I think he can definitely get a lot bigger if he sticks with it. Again, I'm incredibly biased. He's been, he's my neighbor, bro. You know, like he's, he's one of my closest friends right now. So obviously I'm incredibly biased, but you should watch Chrissy Wissy. I like that guy. Let me quickly overview this tier list. I haven't really been ranking them that well on like the tiers themselves. S tier isn't that far apart from A tier. It's more of just people that I think stand out a lot which i think is a pretty important thing because in this community there's gonna be a lot of content creators that kind of just blend in like i don't think my content stands out very much i don't have like i don't have a very distinct personality bro i rarely even crack jokes in my the only humor in my videos is just, like a clip of me and my friends playing some another game so i don't think i'm that unique in that sense i think moss King definitely stands out kind of paving the way for this game jonas as well vanilla and mr rhino they're both pretty good let me organize this a bit better hmm <laughs> From my personal enjoyment, I would probably rank it. <laughs> That's my own little tweakage of this tier list. Did you guys enjoy this? Probably not. This wasn't very um entertaining in a sense. I, I'm not covering anything very deep here. This is just my personal opinion on everything. And the main thing I want to get from this video is that if you guys haven't seen any of these guys, to kind of put y'all on, you know? Um, it's, a few of the people here who are underground, I especially recommend you check out are Cosme, Crusher, and especially Babs. This guy is so funny. If you don't have my sense of humor, you're not going to find him funny at all, and that's completely fine. But if you do, you will really enjoy this guy's videos, and I recommend you peep it. As well as this guy. I Damn, I already forgot his name again, bro. Maz or Maz? <laughs> I'm sorry, Maz, or whatever your name is. Or, or it wasn't Mike, ugh, I feel so bad now, bro. I'm such a Mike. Mike loves it's because he has Maw at the end, bro. I was thinking of Maz, Moss King and Maw. Yo, I'm sorry, Mike. The two videos you made in this game are great. I love them. Keep that stuff up. If you keep playing the game, please make another video. It was good. But yeah, that's my completely biased, not very serious tier list on this game. Um, if I can, I'll leave the description at the bottom where you guys can make your own tier list. If there's somebody you watched that I didn't mention, comment them down below. I'll probably see all your comments. And I think that's about it. Bye bye.